think FSU is one of the greatest principal preparation programs here in especially this part of the state and arguably the nation. It is the beginning of my reinvention. I think at any time you can reinvent. Graduating means to me continuing the legacy of my family and making my family proud. It is a 22 year wait. Um, so it's finally accomplishing the dream that I'd had since graduating in high school. Like, I'm just proud that I'm at the end of this journey. It's been a very hectic one. Coming out of high school, I joined the military first and I came back. And to me, this is like the crowning event. I have all three of my degrees from right here at Federal State University. This is the culmination of my experience as a student and an educator. So I was a first generation college student, so I was one of those kids that wasn't really supposed to be in college. You know, I hope that they make a real impact and, and do wonderful things and have a quality life. Knowledge that we uh, believe is important, prudent for them to understand. Uh, to really set the stage for them to transition to lead American Sons and Daughters. I'm proud to be here and I'm proud of everybody else for making it this far and this is a wonderful feeling and I, I'm just thankful, I'm thankful. We're Bronco Nation and we are proud people and really proud of the legacy of our institution. It's my favorite day of the year. I absolutely love commencement. The students always see it as the end of their academic journey, but we just see it as the beginning of whatever life has in store for them. All of my experiences at FSU helped to mold and shape me uh, into the businessman that I am today. So I want to, uh, to encourage the graduates to, so that they understand that from FSU you can go anywhere and do anything. And so uh, if it happened for me, it can happen for them. That is the primary reason why the rest of us are here today to cheer you on on this glorious day. Class of 2022, you made it. Without you, FSU wouldn't have the number one online MBA program in the nation among HBCUs. And without you, Belva State wouldn't be ranked 15 out of 107 HBCUs in the nation, being the best in the nation. And without you, FSU wouldn't have won four conference championships this year, including one that nearly took us 50 years to obtain. Broncos, be bold enough to reap the rewards of your continued hard work in the weeks and months and years to come. It is your time. Now graduates, I'm gonna give you 10 seconds. You stand to your feet. Cheer yourself on and cheer your colleagues on. 10 seconds. Class of 22, remember you are called, you are capable, and you are covered. We the willing, led by the unknowing, are doing the impossible for the ungrateful. We have done so much with so little for so long, we are now qualified to do anything with nothing. God bless you. From the Board of Trustees of Felber State University, it is my honor and privilege to bestow upon you the Honorary Doctorate of Humane Letters. <laughs>